And we get to level five, Shiver Star. That just looks like the moon. Excuse me for a second while I get Bill Kirby. Die, Cutter, you don't belong in this world. Be gone, monster. You don't belong in this world. Be gone, thought. Be gone, thought. <laughs> <clears throat> there are actually some e girls who are getting really pissed off that it couldn't be, that it couldn't be thoughts on uh, the Twitch platform. Damn. That's. I would like to say sad, but. That, that would be misinterpreting something. I mean, if we're being real, they had it coming. Yeah. Well, Twitch thoughtery aside, I got Drill. A I selected the wrong planet. Alright, let's kill some moon cheese. Sil Silver Star! Let's go! I wanted to make sure I had Drill on hand. Why? Because you need that sweet secret? Yeah, I'm trying to get as many crystals as, as I can. Neat. You really are just steamrolling this entire level just by yep. doing that, huh? <laughs> yep! Look at this magnificent speedrunner right here. Oh, double fi oh, double fire would be a lot faster than this. All I had to do is hold B. Showing in some ways how Drill can be pretty broken. Kirby's Why? coming through. This is not a drill. Oh, but it is. And of oh, course, by wow. making that joke, I, I lose my drill power. This is a drill. Do not be alarmed. This is a drill. Waddle D. Waddle don't, more like it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that works because, well, we only see Waddle 2 in stage 1. I guess if we're being actual, like, level 1 1. Yeah, whatever really occurred to me, but Waddle do, Waddle don't. <laughs> Pun. It never occurred to you until now. Look, I'm not bright. I think we've established here, Shadow. No man is down. Uh, I forgot what combination of power that we need here if it involves ice. Yeti! Oh, you're now definitely involves ice. Yeah, maybe that's an indication that it's in ice. I don't know if you are able to tell, but I was trying to turn around. Yeah, I could not tell. Yeah, this is 
ice by itself. Wait, was that was that snowman just floating? Double ice makes a snowball. And yeah, I think you could say he was Ballin. Snowballer! There's the button, there it is. <clears throat> I guess you could say Kirby knows how to stay cool. Okay, that one I can't, can't vibe with. <laughs> Puns are only fun when they're terrible. Yep, I guess that's half of it. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, buddy. Speaking of steamrolling. <laughs> he steamrolled me! You can't out steamroll the steamroller. The boulder beats the snow every time. The boulder from the avatar. The boulder is conflicted while fighting a young blind girl. The boulder is over his feelings. Uh, the original avatar of the last Terminator was spectacular. The movie was bad. Korra contrived as shit. I mean, I do like moments from season one. Like, for example, exploring uh, extremes on both ends. We have quote unquote equalists, and we have extremist hell benders. Yeah, and I think that's kind of weird though because I'm probably one of those people who are just sitting on the sides of the equalists, just like probably just getting for the avatar to just mow down in like one hit. One of the biggest problems I find is I am the avatar, you gotta deal with it! At the age of 40, you can see her. Perfectly fire bending, water bending, and earth bending. All at the age of four. Damn. What a prodigy. More like Mary Sue, I mean, let's be real. As Avatar Roku puts it best, to master the Avatar takes years of discipline. Yeah, and it sort of just does that, you know? But the logic is, is that there is no logic. <laughs> Give me your money. I mean, if we're being real here, that's their cut sign of Mary Sue Syndrome. Even though she's not the worst offender in Mary Sue Syndrome, she's still pretty bad. Yeah, maybe. I was a bit skeptical, but you convinced me, you convinced me. Yeah, she's not as much of a Mary Sue as she could have been. Yeah, if Mary Sue would be like airbending too, <laughs> and then just like... She just masters everything. The one thing keeping her from being a total Mary Sue is the fact that she couldn't care a bit to save her life. Yeah, or well, just couldn't airbend in general. That's kind of what I was getting at. She couldn't airbend to save her life. But it, but to save her life, she did do it though. <laughs> Only during our encounter with, uh, Amon. Yeah, so technically, she could do it to save her life, but not anywhere else. Only when it's plot convenient. Yeah. And not only that, but, uh, if her to just get her fitting back at the very end... Yeah, that's kind of Mary sue because that's kind of the world changing to benefit for her. Yeah, it's also kind of a... Deus Ex Machina thing where it's like, oh hey, she can suddenly cure this bullshit thing that is brought on by bloodbending or whatever. 
That is an interesting twist, though, how bloodbending can be used to take away the bending of others. That is a good twist to an outlawed power. Yeah, although it's really overpowered how the guy can just bloodbend <laughs> whenever. Especially when it's been established that it can only be done at the full moon when water bending is at its peak. Yeah. Why don't just go from why don't just go from Kirby 64 to Avatar Blast Airbender, I don't know. Ah uh, yeah. Especially during this canon section, basically, where <laughs> I'm just collecting stars and that crystal shard last. Oh, God, I would... why, can't you, why can't you collect those, those crystal shards in the background and the foreground? Because those aren't at the actual shards from the uh, crystal of power. Oh, okay, well, I guess that makes sense, kind of. <laughs> also, there's a reason to hit your face! Uh, Scarfies are a face of that one in me I can't stand. You know how there's one in me you just hate the daylights out of in any uh, franchise? Yeah. Scarface are that one in me for me. In Kirby. Hmm. <laughs> Kinda like how when zombies and my neighbors the uh, Chainsaw Maniac scared me for the longest time. Did it now. Yeah, it's hilariously ironic because put me in front of Freddy Krueger, nothing. Put me in front of the Greg, nothing. But put me in front of a Chainsaw Maniac, ah! Did I really just do that? That did not sound like a scream, that just sounded like something else. <laughs> like you just harnessed your Ara Ara voice just way too much there. Ara Ara. Okay, I know for about that guy, which I'm pretty sure you can't kill in any way, shape, or form. <coughs> quite a few combo power combos I like, but quite a few I don't. And you were on screen. I couldn't get to you. <laughs> what was that voice? That's more of a what is wrong with me voice. You're just like. Arr, arr. I guess I'm constipated all day when I'm frustrated with myself. Yeah, I can. I can see it. No, oh, you see, I could be doing something productive, but I gotta tell the gosh darn kids to get off my lawn! I really gotta show them what's what, you know? It's scary how long I can do the old man voice. It's scary how long I can do the old man voice. The old man voice the is Yeah, the old man voice is something that is especially scary to do well. Yeti! Yeah, that's the goddamn like wheezing voice. Oh, this room. This. 
the room where it happens. Another crystal I'm unable to get, because I don't have the power required for it. You don't have enough life insurance. Uh, you know the worst part is I think that's uh, lightning and a spark and needle. Oh, because it's yellow and orange, obviously. Yeah, I think that's spike and needle. Some spike and needle. And there's a stage I need to drill for. Yeah, also, why is the, why are these worlds in crayon? <laughs> and like, they look like they're drawn in crayon. On like a piece of post-it <clears throat> note. <clears throat> I don't know, but I do think it's a nice aesthetic. I mean, yeah, it really does nail the like, not so serious, like, planning sort of phase, I guess. Well, yeah, especially since uh, Kirby's meant to be a lighthearted game. Hell, in Kirby Trouble Deluxe, you have Waddle Dee's just inconveniencing you by just doing menial tasks, like going for a walk. <clears throat> Don't you hate it when Kirby, like, scams your grandma out of, like, her money? Because I, I, I hate when that happens. If you're referring to that one game, then I guess maybe. What? Wait, you're telling me that there is a game where Kirby can <laughs> scam my grandma? What? No, I'm talking that one Kirby game that has microtransactions. Where you buy oh. apples and grow the tree. I believe it's Kirby Super Clash. Where it's basically just a, um,. Okay, sorry for the cut. I got an Xbox notification of some asshole creating a group post. Yeah, imagine if that was me. That'd be weird <laughs> if that was me. <clears throat> and I route my Switch to uh, my uh, Xbox One as the uh, central media hub. Ooh, I do that. It's a, it's a bit more convenient for me that way. Ah. <clears throat> the uh, vanilla Xbox One has this like a HDMI port, but you can plug anything in and go to one guide. It's really handy. Why do I feel like an old man who hasn't been in touch with technology since like the 1980s? I don't know. I'm glad I kept up with it all, the, all these years. Yeah, but meanwhile, I still am like glorifying CDs over here. Okay, boomer. Damn it, you, you, you got me. You are! Well, you kind of are the personification of a boomer. It's, yeah. You know what? I kind of am. Yeah, another reason why I love Jarrell. Just fire it randomly with reckless abandon. <laughs> Yeah, I can just basically salmon around my way through here. I said, I said salmon, didn't I? Yeah, you sure did. You sure did. I heard it. Salmon around. Like, uh, I named a piece of salmon after Samus. Yeah, not not the best moment. <laughs> uh, Samus would be insulted. Yeah, probably salmon around. <laughs> I definitely need to remember that one and have that as an enemy in my game, just Salmon Aran. Yeah, just like, piece of salmon with legs. Or a, uh, 
sa or a piece of salmon that is basically a living fish. Like speaking of, there is actually a moment in Dagan Rampe anime where you see Monokuma beating up a dead fish. Oh really? Yes. It is the best moment in the anime. I haven't actually seen the anime. I've only played the games and also Danganronpa 3. <laughs> I still need to play Danganronpa 2 and 3. But Holy Maidith was that moment, the best moment in the anime. <laughs> you don't get that in the games, unfortunately. <clears throat> Die! Execute order 66. Plan I've, to eradicate the Satans. I feel like I could have gotten him in one cycle. What do you got for us? Peach, cherry, orange? I believe that is a one-eyed frog. No, these are very separate fruits. He paints specifically the ones you need to press. That's oh, peach, okay. cherry, orange. He paint orange because orange is good. Oh wait, she does that as a bit of a. Never mind. So peach being pink, cherries are typically red. And we press Orang! Because Orang is good! Because Orang is good. Me like Snake! We go back! The Orang is good! Orang is good. God damn it, Puddle Stick! You got me doing that! Yay! Yeah, and yes, all in good cases. Because that's what everyone needs in their life. And yes, that's instant death if you get crushed by it. Damn, that's unforgiving. It's still fairly forgiving because you have ample time to get out of the way. Yeah, but imagine like the first time going in there and then just getting squash. Hey, what's wrong with squash, man? Uh, you, you, you know what I meant. You know what I meant. <laughs> no, I think you just hate squash. Yeah, you're right. I hate squash. What of it? <laughs> squash by a lawsuit of discrimination. Damn. Smosh, too. I also hate. But I also <laughs> like Smosh. Uh, jokes, jokes aside. I don't particularly care too much for a squash, but at the same time, though, it's healthy for you, so... I never even had squash. <laughs> Something. It is indeed a thing that exists. <laughs> it is a really handy plant in, uh, Plants for the Zombies. You know what? It sure <laughs> is. <laughs> it's as NCS coined. TT... Like, T... -t TSPP. How to get the acronym right. Temporary solution to a permanent problem. <laughs> permanent problem being zombies. Yeah, hence TSPP. Also, this area. I don't like the fact that they bother to put Shotso in the background. Or you gotta pay- you gotta pay close attention to where the, uh, shots are gonna go. You don't necessarily need to take cover. Yeah, although it's a nice place to take a break, unwind, I'm like a beer. Lead, I mean, like, lead its fire and go to where it's not gonna be, obviously. Like, alternate between letting it fire up and down. Yeti! Yeah, 